I'm going to show you how I created a cozy boutique hotel experience in my home with captive portals. Let's go. By the end of this video, when your guests log into your home Wi-Fi, this is the screen that they're gonna see. Very good. Here's what you're gonna need. A Raspberry Pi with Ethernet port and an Ethernet cable. The first thing we're gonna do is install Rasp AP. It will turn our Raspberry Pi into an access point and if done successfully, you will see a new Wi-Fi network called Raspi Web GUI. Next, we are going to install Nodog Splash. Nodog Splash is the simplest captive portal software. We are going to change a few configurations to match our Rasp AP access point, and voila! If you pass this stage, you should get the default Nodog Splash Splash HTML page when you log into the network. Now I want to change it to include a nice home picture and something more hotel-y in the vibe. I envision a picture of a beautiful boutique hotel with a text that says Welcome to the Royal Rupin Relax. I live on Rupin Street, so it makes sense. Let's start with the image. For this I will use Leonardo AI. This website generates beautiful images from prompts and I got this one which I really liked and I downloaded it and done. Now we need to design the actual HTML and CSS. This can be a hassle so I am going to use Vine. I downloaded the required Nodog Splash files and put them in a folder. Now let's connect Find to this project, set up a notebook to define my task, and let's run the agent. The agent will generate tasks like editing the splash HTML and CSS files according to my vision. Once the tasks are defined, we can let the agent execute them. Boom! An AI agent totally changed the HTML and CSS so it matches my vision. I'm just gonna make a last few tweaks, and alright, I updated the Wi-Fi to be called Royal Rupin Relax Guest and the Captive Portal is up and running. Check it out.